Howdy, y'all. I hope you can all see and hear me. I've been having... My equipment's been fighting me today, but I wanted to get this out there because for some reason, last night I decided to pull this out. This is the Maestro by Gibson. Um, I got it at Goodwill, actually, and uh, it wasn't very much. And um, When I pulled it out of the case, because I had just thrown it in a case and kind of forgotten all about it, I remember... Uh, when I got it, I, the neck was weird and I wanted to let it, uh, I uh, adjusted a tr truss rod and wanted to let it set for a little bit, but I think I said it, let it, let it set like a few months, um, to longer than I wanted to, uh, let it set. Um, but the neck is now very nice and straight. Uh, <laughs> had to do a lot of, uh, fret work on it, um, last night cause the, uh, yeah, definitely needed, uh, leveling and, um, recrowning. Um, and a little polish in there, and uh, the fretboard was so dry. And this thing sounds a lot better when, it's, when you can just hear the amp and it's not through the, the mic. I gotta try a different mic because that one's not very good for this. So maybe I, I do have another one. Maybe I'll swap them out and see what happens with that, see if it sounds a little better. But. <laughs> I apologize i still can't well i can't play in the first place but i really can't play because my thumb is still healing from a stupid cut it's good it's healing very quickly nicely but that got that little flap of skin there and i just i didn't feel like ripping it off just yet i'll wait a little bit until that but yeah so i gotta get this stupid band-aid off my thumb before i can actually play start to try and play better again because i can't play very well now anyway so decided on this one yet but um i might i might take this thing apart i might take the the pickup out and see uh what kind of wiring there is in there i do have some push pull pots maybe if there if it's a four wire um pickup maybe i can do a little coil splitting on this thing um these things i looked online they're about between 150 and 200 dollars uh, and maybe i can bump that up a couple of dollars there with a little coil splitting um to me to me these yeah i keep seeing all these guitars that are uh, uh they're being sold as uh, beginner guitars this to me is a beginner guitar it has very little working parts no tremolo um and it's just this to me would be what a, a beginner guitar would be because it is electrified you got to pick up there you can i mean just a, a, with the volume alone. get all sorts of tones out of this thing and, it, and it's fun to play and no working parts man it's a you know that to me this is a beginner guitar and uh and and having it set up correctly for someone that that's what i want to do i want to be able to hand a kid this and be like yeah man this one is good to go try it see what you see what you can do you know that to me would be amazing it's like here here's potential what can you do with it you know um and help make the world a better place that's all anyways uh so i just wanted to get that out there show you that i do do some work every once in a while and this one's pretty nice uh, anybody got 150 bucks they want to give me right now i'll take it uh <laughs> but uh, besides that i hope you're all having a great day always look up and i'll see you then peace